<laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Yeah, um, yeah we will have a look at uh, this radio here. This is an old Russian transceiver or something like that, probably. Uh, and it was sold on eBay right now. I have to ship it today. There are only a few minutes left. So, yeah, we will have a look inside just for the fun of it. And by the way, many, many thanks to my supporters on Patreon. You guys rock! Thank you so much! And here's a list of them. Um, I haven't updated it um, some time ago. Uh, yeah. Poor, uh, I don't know which one is still in the list, but thank you all. You were donating and you, you certainly still are. And that's great. Without you, we would not have a look inside here. Because, yeah, I need your support. And there is a new patron. Tim Felepa. Two dollars a month. Thank you. And Doug Chase. Five dollars a month. Yeah! Okay, let's have a look inside now. Okay. Uh, I won't open up these shieldings here. Uh, hopefully there's at least one uh, that is open. Else I, uh, of course, will open one up. But yeah, this is sold and I don't want to to destroy any uh, alignment or something like that. There was someone in here like uh, 33 years ago. This is the inside of the cabinet of the enclosure. Very nice build. Is this military stuff? Look at that. This is very ruggedized. Excellent. Yeah, I don't speak Russian, unfortunately. Uh, yeah. Yobani Vrot, but that's all that I can say. Wow, this is very beautiful. Look at this chassis. This is build quality. Excellent. Wow. Wow. I like this very, very much. Excellent. What? The capacitor is from 1986? Wonderful stuff. And underneath we will find this here. Beautiful. It's a beautiful transformer. Nice diodes. Uh, paper and oil capacitor. Another neat transformer here. Wow, the wire harness. This is beautiful. And look how it is installed here. Wonderful! Wow! I love this stuff. That's excellent. Okay, this has to be a very high quality capacitor that we have seen before. Very nice! Excellent! So, let's lift up one of them. We will not destroy anything. Um, these screws are already opened up. So, yeah, let's do it quick. Nice. This is great. This is how you service units. Excellent. Okay. I've removed all the screws. Let's lift up this cover here. This is not gigahertz mega cycle stuff. Uh, so we won't destroy any alignment by just uh, open up, uh, opening up the can, of course. So I'm very curious. Again, thanks to my patrons. You make this possible. Wow. Beautiful. 
Look at this heatsink. And the die cast aluminium chassis. These are tantalum capacitors here, the silver ones. And these ones here too, I guess. There are two transformers, probably. Hmm, interstage transformers. Very nice quality. Really. I was about to lift up this cover here, but then I saw that there's nothing to see here. This is only the bottom of the PCB. And of course I won't uh, uh, unsolder all the cables here to have a look inside. This is, uh, yeah. Uh, if it was a teardown, yes, but this unit has to leave today. It is sold and yeah, I want a happy customer. And it's still working, look at that. These are tiny, tiny, tiny seven segments displays. Beautiful. Even seems to work. It is sold, untested, faulty. But yeah, let's make one happy. It will be shipped right now. Thanks for watching and see you again soon. Bye. And there we go, look at that. And there's still a lot of space for cushing material. And that's it. That's a good box. Wonderful. Ready to go. And that's another order for a tube amp manufacturer. Yeah, quite a lot to ship today. Fortunately. There are days with one or zero parcels. There are days with 10 parcels or even more. I once had 17 on one day. But that's, that's okay here. I'm happy with that.